Well, it happened, we got another robot. Joining the noob household this month is the IronBot Home Edition Kit from Robospace. The IronBot is a kid-friendly robotics kit that has some serious hardware for young robot enthusiasts. In the box is a full-color illustrated manual in both Chinese and English with plans for three different robots and, ooh, shiny robot parts. The body is comprised of an aluminum frame with a fantastic looking paint job. Mine came in red. The parts are lightweight yet sturdy. The servos that give the robot life are hobby grade and use standard servo connectors so they can be easily replaced or upgraded should the need arise. There's a good bit of hardware here and everything is accounted for in the manual and small items such as screws are bagged and tagged in Ziploc pouches. After going through the manual and deciding which robot to build with my son, helping him with the first few steps and showing him how to use the tools, I left the construction to him and, well, I'll let him tell you more. I think it was actually kind of fun to build the robot. The instructions were mostly easy to follow, but the translation, of course, was a bit weird. The only problems we ran into during construction were that the screws can strip easily, so try not to over-tighten them, and at some point they decided to use a different hole pattern on a few pieces than what was indicated in the manual. This ended up not being an issue, though, as everything still went together as it should. In a little less than an hour, we had a fully constructed robot. Just add a smartphone and you're ready to boogie. Okay, so we needed to work on his moves a little bit. Isaac, the Android and iOS app for IronBot, is easy to use and works over Bluetooth for wireless programming and control. Kids can control each servo individually to program a series of poses and then combine the actions with voice control prompts, facial expressions, music, and speech using the simple X-Link block-based scripting interface. This allows kids and adults with no programming experience to create advanced interactions with their IronBot. I believe that the programming was kind of easy, except it was kind of confusing in some ways. You look pretty strong. Check this out. Take a picture. Okay, say chase. I think that if there was a bit more to the excellent part of it, then it would make it be a lot better and more fun. And also if it could actually walk. At first, I was a bit upset whenever it couldn't walk, so we tried to figure it out, but it didn't really work that well. Overall, the IronBot is a great robotic kit for kids and the young at heart. It's fun to build, easy to use, and built well enough to last. Just don't make them angry.